Good morning, everybody. Wanted to show you a high water fruit recipe for breakfast. I'm a huge fan of the high water fruit for breakfast. Uh, ever since I've been adopting my new strategy for 801010, I've been doing high water fruit every morning. I'm not saying don't do bananas, but I think that a really hydrating first meal is going to make you feel a lot better during the day and give you sustained energy. I like to hit the really high water stuff in the morning and then do bananas at lunch every day. So I'm just going to show you what we got here. High water breakfast. We've got uh, orange juice, mango, and pineapple. Now I could just drink that whole thing of orange juice, uh, but for the sake of this video, I want to show you a recipe that you can do, and it's basically a smoothie with orange juice as the base, and then mango and pineapple. But feel free to do just orange juice and mango, or just orange juice and pineapple, or just even mango and pineapple. Uh, though for that recipe, you might need a little bit of water. So I got my frozen pineapple, some Kent mangoes, and some OJ that I made last night. About uh, two liters of OJ, the mango cut up, and the pineapple, and we'll just throw that all in the Vitamix and blender up. So we got uh, orange juice, a couple of mangoes, and then just topped off as much as I could with pineapple. Our finished product, 64 ounces of high water, high sugar, high vitamin, high mineral deliciousness. Guys, so that's pretty much my formula for the high water breakfast. I'm a really big fan of it now. I used to do a banana smoothie every day for breakfast, and I always felt like it never quite digested that great. And then I saw Dr. Rocker, Lockhart's video about how the digestive system works the best between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m., and that's when you should eat the majority of your food. And ever since I started doing this high water breakfast a little bit before I saw that video, I've been feeling a lot better. I feel like it digests a lot faster, and I feel like I have more energy in the morning, and I don't feel like I'm spending any time digesting, which is great because I can drink it you know, before or after a workout without any problems. And I really feel like this high water fruit thing is a good way, good strategy for the 80-10-10 lifestyle. And uh, it starts your day off hydrated, and I think that uh, it's something you can do year round too. So right now summer's ending, and you know I still have the mangoes and the pineapples, but pretty soon that's going to go away. But then the oranges are really going to come into season, so I'll be drinking like a lot of orange juice, a lot of grapefruit juice, and I can do stuff like blend grapes into that or other high water fall fruits. And uh, it's I'm, it's definitely something I'm looking forward to, and I highly recommend it. So. Just to recap, high water fruit for breakfast, calorie dense meal, bananas, dates, figs, persimmons for lunch, and a little bit of fruit and a big vegetable meal for dinner. That has been working really well for me, and I'll continue to make videos on this topic. Thanks for watching.